Welcome, Tercero Básico. Today we're going to have a review about questions. Also, I'm going to explain um, WH questions. I hope you watch this video and you can uh, watch it many times because it has like two readings. Watch it, please. English course, Tercero Básico. Welcome to this video. Take a look. Yeah. Questions review. Hoy vamos a ver un tema que en general ya tienen que poderlo manejar y si lo han olvidado pues lo vamos a recordar. Es acerca de cómo se preguntas en el tiempo presente simple. Do you have? Siempre la pregunta va a ir dirigida para usted. Do you? Tú. Do you have? Tienes. Do you have? Do you have a car? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Do you study English? Yes, I do. No, I don't. You see? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Do you go to the park? Yes, I do. No, I don't. En esta ocasión, vamos a recordar el auxiliar tú con you. También les voy a recordar sobre las WH questions, que son las palabras que empiezan con la W y con la H. Por ejemplo, what? Where, who, why, when, what, qué, where, en dónde, who, quién, why, por qué, when, cuándo. Listen to the conversation in page number. 24, section 1. Lo voy a leer y usted va a poner atención. ¿Ok? Ok. La lectura dice así. What's your name? My name is Max. Max Paul. How old are you, Max? I'm 14. Where do you come from? I come from Santa Mexico. Tell me about your... Well, there's my mom and my dad, and I have two sisters. How old are they? Ross is nine and Lily is six. Have any pets? Yeah, a cat. What are your hobbies, Max? What are your hobbies, Max? I like shopping and collecting. What kind of things? Well, designer clothes. Ok, en el page number 25 tenemos una lectura que es diferente a la que les acabo de leer. No se vayan a confundir, por favor. Esta habla acerca de Max. Bueno, también vamos a ser diferente. Yo lo leo y ustedes van a escuchar, ok? Max is a boy with his tight clothes and he likes shopping. But his parents don't let him have a lot of money. So, today afternoons he will sign a clothes shop in Santa Fe. He gets $18 for 3 hours. Doesn't spend a lot of money in clothes. But he collects bags from designers. ¿Saben qué son bags? Son bolsas de bolsas de tiendas de diseño. Ads from magazines. Ads significa anuncios. And on the wall in his room. Sick means pegar. Los pone en su pared, en su cuarto. That means limpio, pulpo, ordenado. Yo can say ordenado. He likes showing his room to friends. But he doesn't let his little sisters play in it. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you can watch it many times. Por favor, véanlo muchas veces. Hay información muy importante para que puedan desarrollar los ejercicios que tienen en sus libros.